Today I'm going to be showing you a really useful tool to compress video. So, here let me navigate to where it's located on my hard drive. Um, it's called Total Video Converter. It's not free. I actually paid for it, so y y um, you're going to have to do the same. Um, all right, now that now that it's open, what we're gonna do? Um, is just drag and drop any video that you have that you want to compress into this input file name. This may take a while. Okay. Hold on. Okay. Once it's in there, you're gonna wanna decide what format you want the video to be converted to. The most uh, common file is AVI, but it has the worst compression out of all of them. So I would recommend keeping it at an MP4. Just make sure um, your computer can play back MP4 files. Windows Media Player will not play MP4. In order to play MP4, you may be required to install VLC Media Player or any other media player ensuring that there's compatibility with MP4. Once you figure out which format you want to convert to, you have to edit the profile. You can use one that's already preset, but I would recommend you edit it and choose what you'd like. Um, depending on what you want, is your resolution. Um, I usually keep mine at 640 by 420 and a really good thing is H.264. It has a lot better compression compared to MPEG-4 and your bitrate to compress it, bring it down a little. You know, don't make dramatic uh, decreases or else you know, you're gonna kill the quality and that's not the point. H.264 does actually allow you to you know save a lot more quality than you would with MPEG-4 but H.264 takes a lot longer to encode but you're just gonna need more patience audio um, depending on what it all depends what you want to use this for as well I usually bring keep mine at 256 but this time I'm bringing it down to 128k you should keep the audio format at that um, if you want the uh, volume, like say your video is really low in volume, you can increase that. And you can play around with the channel, audio channels. But once you're ready to uh, compress, just hit this convert button and it'll convert your video and you'll be done. Hope you learned something. I apologize if I made this too complex. Um, I'll make it better next time. Have a nice day. See ya.